Hello. Yes, that's right. Nick Griffin abandoned the good people of Oldham. Like he abandoned the good people of West Yorkshire. And many other uh, towns and cities surrounded by hostile neighbours. But in particular, you've abandoned the voters of the North West. Oldham being part of that. I'm sure you're all well aware of the violence that occurred in Oldham over the weekend. Tommy Robinson was there. And Tommy Robinson's supporters were attacked by a mob of 300 racist Muslims under the banner of the Muslim Defence League. Some were hit with stones, some were physically beaten up, reports that some were stabbed. Real shocking scenes of violence and the police, as usual, did nothing. But you see, Nick Griffin, you've abandoned these people because Tommy Robinson shouldn't have been there. We should have been there, right? We should have been there. Like we were there in 2001 when elderly war veteran Walter Chamberlain was beaten up by Muslim racists. We went into Oldham and we literally were the people's defenders. You know we were. People are running out of public houses, coming over, shaking your hand. People were crossing the road. We were literally there to defend the people of Oldham from Muslim racist attacks. You know we were. And what happened? You got elected to the European Parliament, courtesy of all those good people. And then what? You've done nothing. Literally nothing, right? In fact, you spent most of your time outside courts and police stations championing the very people destroying the BNP or talking nonsense in the European Parliament. I won't mention, but you know, the usual nonsense, right? And so we should have been there, not Tommy Robinson. We should have stayed in Oldham campaigning with Mick Treacy until we got a councillor or councillors elected. Like we should have stayed in Burnley. Like we should have stayed in Barking and Dagenham and Stoke and you. It's all down to you. Right? You're having a, what, BMP reunion in the North West in September. What? Reminiscing about failure and how you handed the BMP over to Hope Not Hate Spies, Adam Walker and... Uh, Clive Jefferson, is that going to be the topic? Oh, I very much doubt it. Yeah, you can't even come and meet me, can you? Because I'll tell you the truth, right? I'll tell you as it is, and you know I will. Do you know that old and Nick Griffin? Me, you and Nick Treacy, Mick Treacy, sorry. Me, you and Mick Treacy, we could get that back up and running overnight, right? And once we got one up and running, the rest will follow. But you're too busy pontificating, uh reunions and all this nonsense and who's organizing that and why you see i'll tell you why i get a lot of emails you see nick questioning me trying to get information out of me do you still see nick uh, do you, does he ring you know, what's happening over this party you'd be surprised and maybe this is just another fishing exercise by hope not hate i don't know right i don't know only you'll know right you'll find out no doubt when you have the reunion. But a reunion about what? All raise your glasses to what? Failure and surrender. We should have been in Oldham instead of that state snitch, Tommy Robinson, who's only gone there to wind the Muslims up anyway, like he's going to do tonight in Preston, then Burnley, then Blackburns. Hopefully, so it goes bang. 2001 style, Darren Wells, remember? Well, it's, this, it's literally the same modus operandi, what's happening now. And Tommy Robinson's only standing in the European elections to take votes from the, Bre the Brexit party, right? So, you know... You've let the good people of Oldham down, Nick Griffin. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Never mind organising reunions, talking hogwash and poppycock. Okay, thank you.